ಪಾಗರ್ಥಾವಿಗ ಸಂಪರ್ಕವು ಆಗರ್ಥ ಪ್ರತಿಪತ್ತೇ ಜಗತ ಪಿತರೌ ಒಂದೇ ಪಾರ್ವತಿ ಪರಮೇಶ್ವರ ಫಿನಿಶ್ಡ್ ದಿ ಶೂರ್ಪನಖ ಇನ್ಸಿಡೆಂಟ್ ಸಾವಕ್ರ ನಖ ದಾರಿಣ್ಯ ವೇಣು ಕರ್ಕಶ ಪರ್ವಯ ಅಂಕುಶಾಕಾರಯಾಂಗುಲ್ಯ ತೌ ಅತರ್ಜಯತ್ ಅಂಬರೆ ಸುಸಾ ರಾಕ್ಷಸಿ ಶೂರ್ಪಣಖ ಶ್ರೀ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ವೈರೂಪ್ಯಕರಣ ಅದು ಯಾರು ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮಣ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮಣ ಡಿಸೈಡ್ ಟು ಕಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಹರ್ ನೋಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಇಯರ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸೊ ಹಿ ಮೇಡ್ ಹರ್ ಅಗ್ಲಿ ಶಿ ಗಾಟ್ ರಿಯಲಿ ಆಂಗ್ರಿ ಅಂಡ್ ಶಿ ಬ್ಲೇಮ್ಡ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಶಿ ಶಿ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಬ್ಲೇಮ್ಡ್ ಸೀತಾ ಬಟ್ ಅಟ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಶಿ ಥ್ರೆಟೆಂಡ್ ಬೋತ್ ರಾಮ ಅಂಡ್ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮಣ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಆಕಾಶನ್ ಶಿ ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ಹರ್ ಫಿಂಗರ್ ಟು ಥ್ರೆಟನ್ ಯು ನೋ ವೆನ್ ವಿ ಯೂಶಲಿ ಥ್ರೆಟನ್ ವಿ ವಿ ಯೂಸ್ ದ ದ ದ ಫಿಂಗರ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಫಿಂಗರ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ತರ್ಜನಿ ತರ್ಜನಿ ಇತ್ಯುಕ್ತೆ ದಟ್ ವಿಚ್ ವಿ ಯೂಸ್ ಟು ಥ್ರೆಟನ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಹರ್ ಶಿ ಹ್ಯಾಡ್ ಅ ಲಾಂಗ್ ಕ್ರೂಕೆಡ್ ನೇಲ್ ವಿಚ್ ಲುಕ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಬೂ Uh, her entire uh, finger with the nail looked like a bamboo and uh, an ankusha ankusha is that which uh, mahot uses uh, for a, an elephant to make it uh, uh, come under his control so she threatened both rama and lakshmana from the akasha and went away where did she go now kharadushana episode starts from this shloka 42nd prapyacha ashu janasthanam ಖರಾಧಿಭ್ಯ ತಥಾವಿಧಂ ರಾಮೋಪಕ್ರಮ ಆಚಖ್ಯೌ ರಕ್ಷ ಪರಿಭವ ನವಂ ಪ್ರಾಪ್ಯ ಚ ಆಶು ಜನಸ್ಥಾನ ಜನಸ್ಥಾನ ಚ ಆಶು ಪ್ರಾಪ್ಯ ಅತ್ರ ತು ಕರ್ತೃಪದ ನಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ದ ಕರ್ತ ಹಿಯರ್ ಯು ಡೋಂಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ದಟ್ ಪದಂ ಹಿಯರ್ ಸೊ ವಿ ಟೇಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದಿ ಅರ್ಲಿಯರ್ ಶ್ಲೋಕ ಸೊ ಸಾ ಸಾ ಶೂರ್ಪಣಖ ಶಿ ಇಮಿಡಿಯೇಟ್ಲಿ ವೆನ್ ಟು ಜನಸ್ಥಾನ ಜನಸ್ಥಾನ ಈಸ್ ಎನ್ ಏರಿಯಾ it is you can give the vyutpatti for that uh, the word by saying janasya sthanam or jananam sthanam iti janasthanam but the word itself is a samgnya padam it is not uh, uh, um, uh, then the name it is not jana iti sthanam it is more like jananam sthanam uh, it can be a city it could have been a vanapradesha nothing of that sort is mentioned in ramayana so janasthanam is the name of a place within dandakaranyam okay so janasthanam ashu prapya ashu immediately quickly she reached janasthanam because kara and dushana who were cousins of uh, uh, ravana were present there and they were uh, taking care of that area that is like the uh, seema of uh, uh, ravana's lank, uh, 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 country so ravana's country extended up to this janasthanam where khara dushana along with the, their senapati trishiras were taking care of that border it's like the border control of ravana's army so khara uh, uh, khara also is her uh, cousin that is ravana kumbakarna vibhishana and shurpanaka were born to vishravas and uh, kaikashi or kai uh, kaikeshi kaikashi's sister's children were khara and dushana so they were cousins there so janasthanam cha ashu prapya immediately quickly reaching janasthana she told uh, uh, to khara and others khara dibhyaha ಆಚಖ್ಯೌ ಆಚಖ್ಯೌ ಇಸ್ ಯುವರ್ ವರ್ಬ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಆಚಖ್ಯೌ ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ರಾಮೋಪಕ್ರಮ ಆಚಖ್ಯೌ ಆಚಖ್ಯೌ ಇಸ್ ಇನ್ ಲಿಟ್ಲ ಕಾರ ಆಂಗ್ ಉಪಸರ್ಗ ಚಕ್ಷಿಂಗ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಧಾತು ಚಕ್ಷಿಂಗ್ ಧಾತು ಲಟ್ಲಕಾರೆ ತು ಆಚಷ್ಟೇ ಇತಿ ಭವತಿ ಪರಂತು ಲಿಟ್ಲಕಾರೆ ಇಟ್ ಟೇಕ್ಸ್ ಆನ್ ಖ್ಯ so chakshing uh, uh, i think chakshing uh, just like how you have aster bhuhu um, <coughs> for as dhatu you have asti staha santi but in little akara you have it lit you uh, it takes on bhu dhatu and it becomes bhavishyati instead of something like asishyati or something like that in the same manner there are other dhatus also which undergo such, such uh, substitution one of those is this chakshing dhatu which takes on khya and hence the lit form of chakshing is chakhyau a chakhyau she told 
ಉವಾಚ ದಟ್ಸ್ ದ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಟ್ ಅವದತ್ ಸೊ ಸ ಶೂರ್ಪನಖ ಜನಸ್ಥಾನ ಪ್ರಾಪ್ಯ ಖರಾದಿವ್ಯ ಆಚಕ್ಯ ಶಿ ಟೋಲ್ಡ್ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಖರ ಅಂಡ್ ಅದರ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಡಿಡ್ ಶಿ ಸೇ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಎಲ್ಸ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಕರ್ಮಪದಂ ಫಾರ್ ದಟ್ ತಥಾವಿಧಂ ರಾಮೋಪಕ್ರಮಂ ರಕ್ಷ ಪರಿಭವಂ ನವಂ ರಕ್ಷ ಪರಿಭವಂ ಆಚಕ್ಯೌ ಶಿ ಟೋಲ್ಡ್ ವಾಟ್ ಎವರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪನ್ ಟು ಹರ್ ತಥಾವಿಧಂ ತಥಾವಿಧಂ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಶಿ ವೆಂಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಆಸ್ಡ್ ಹಿಮ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ದೇ ಕಳತ್ರಮಾನ ಅಹಂ ಬಾಲೆ ಕನೀಯಾಂ ಸಂ ಭಜಸ್ವಮೇ ಇ ರಾಮ ಅವದತ್ ಸೊ ಅಪಿ ಜ್ಯೇಷ್ಠ ಅಭಿಗಮನಾತ್ ಪೂರ್ವ ಯು ವೆಂಟ್ ಟು ದಿ ಎಲ್ಡರ್ ಬ್ರದರ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸೊ ದೆನ್ ಯು ಕೇಮ್ ಲೇಟರ್ ಟು ಮೀ ಹಿ ರಿಜೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಯು ಸೊ ಐ ಕೆ ನಾಟ್ ಅಕ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಯು ವೆನ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಸಾಟ್ ರಾಮ ಬಿಫೋರ್ ಇತಿ ಕನಿಷ್ಠ ಅಪಿ ಅವದತ್ and then she was played football like this between the two of them after that uh, when she approached um, sita because sita laughed maithili hasaha became a provocation for uh, shurpanaka so she went and tried to attack uh, sita at that point lakshmana became angry and he cut off her nose and ears this entire episode tatha vidham that is your whatever happened before earlier the few shlokas in a nutshell but rama upakramam it is something that was started by rama rama could have very well just said reject that's all i have my wife here i cannot marry you i don't like you but he also sent her to lakshmana saying he is not with his wife you can go there it is like a something that has been started by rama rama upakramam uh, he will also say ramasya udyamam iti or ramasya prarambha you can say it as something that was started by rama but it turned out to be a new kind of navam rakshaf paribhavam rakshaf paribhavah tu it is an insult so this is like a new insult that rama has started tathavidha she has anything is there in the perspective of the person who speaks also right so when you there is an incident that happened two people that's why you have lawyers fighting in a court also the same incident are perceived and portrayed in two different manner that's why you people fight there here also when shurpanaka who is a victim or who is who is one of the persons involved in that incident she portrays it in such a manner that she says you know what whatever rama started this this whole thing whatever happened tatha vidham rama upakramam tu navam rakshav paribhavam asti iti so she she paribhavah so it is like a new insult that has happened to all these rakshasas iti achakyo so she she portrayed it in such a manner that she said this is like a new insult for uh, uh, all of us our clan hmm? is that clear so sa ashu shigram eva ashu is an avyaya uh, the other you might have heard uh, shiva is called ashutosha one who is very easily pleased quickly pleased so ashu toshaha iti the bengali people have the name of ashtosh or ashtosh right that's only ashu toshaha so such a ashu sa ashu shigram eva janasthanam so this sa is from the earlier shloka so put it in a bracket because this word is not present in this uh, uh, shloka ಶೀಘ್ರಮೇವ ಜನಸ್ಥಾನ ಪ್ರಾಪ್ಯ ಖರಾದಿಭ್ಯ ಫೋರ್ತ್ ಕೇಸ್ ರಾಕ್ಷಸೇಭ್ಯ ಖರ ಖರ ಅಂಡ್ ಅದರ್ ರಾಕ್ಷಸಸ್ ತಥಾವಿಧಂ ಸ್ವ ಅಂಗಛೇದಾತ್ಮಕ ರಾಮ ಉಪಕ್ರಮ ರಾಮ ಉದ್ಯಮ ದಿ ಎಫರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ರಾಮ ವಿಚ್ ಇನ್ಕ್ಲೂ ವಿಚ್ ವಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ದಟ್ ಸಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಅ ಮ್ಯಾನರ್ ತಥಾವಿಧಂ ವಿಚ್ ಇನ್ಕ್ಲೂಡೆಡ್ ಸ್ವ ಅಂಗಛೇದ ಕಟ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ಹರ್ ಬಾಡಿ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ನವಂ ನೂತನ ರಕ್ಷ ಪರಿಭವ ರಕ್ಷಸ ಪರಿಭವ ರಾಕ್ಷಸ ಇಸ್ ಅ ವರ್ಡ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ರಕ್ಷ ಇಸ್ ಅನ್ ಅಪುಂಸಕಲಿಂಗ ವರ್ಡ್ ಯಾತು ರಕ್ಷಸಿ ಇತಿ ಅಮರಕೋಶೆ ವರ್ತತೆ ಸೊ ಯಾತು ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಅನದರ್ ನಪುಂಸಕಲಿಂಗ ವರ್ಡ್ ಫಾರ್ ರಾಕ್ಷಸ ರಕ್ಷ ರಕ್ಷಸಿ ರಕ್ಷಾಂಸಿ ಯಾತು ಯಾತುನಿ ಯಾತೂನಿ ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಟು ಆರ್ ನಪುಂಸಕಲಿಂಗ ವರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ರಾಕ್ಷಸ okay so rakshav paribhavam rakshasam paribhavam you take it as sakaranta padam 
and you decline it as shiraha manaha manasi manamsi iti vat aachakhyau aakhyatavati or avadat saashurpanakha shigrameva rakshasam nilayam janasthanam prapya she went to janasthana which is the nilayam griham or place sthanam of the rakshasas prapya tatratyebhya kara pramukebhya kara is the word uh, is the name of the, uh, uh, the they are actually twin brothers khara and dushana so khara pramukhebhya khara and other important people who were present there tatratya tatra bhavaha tatratya one who is present in that janasthanam so janasthane ye ye santi tebhya khara pramukhebhya rakshasebhya swa anga vairupyam ಆಪಾದಿತವಂತ ರಾಮಲಕ್ಷ್ಮಣೌ ಪ್ರತಿಕರ್ತು ಉದ್ಯುಕ್ತ ರಾಕ್ಷಸಕುಲಸ್ಯವ ಅಯಂ ಪರಿಭವ ಇತಿ ಉಚ್ಚೈ ಘೋಷಿತವತಿ ಸೋ ಸೊ ರಾಕ್ಷಸೇಭ್ಯ ಟು ದೋಸ್ ರಾಕ್ಷಸಸ್ ಉಚ್ಚೈ ಘೋಷಿತವತಿ ಶಿ ಲೌಡ್ಲಿ ಪ್ರೊಕ್ಲೇಮ್ಡ್ ಟು ದ ರಾಕ್ಷಸಸ್ ದಟ್ ರಾಕ್ಷಸಕುಲಸ್ಯವ ಅಯಂ ಪರಿಭವ ಇತಿ she proclaimed to all of them that this is a paribhava an insult for the entire rakshasa kula but why did she want to say this because swa anga vairupyam aapaditavantau ramalakshmanau pratikartum udyukta udyukta she was uh, ready to pratikartum to take revenge to do something opposite to badalukku pandradun solrom alli adhu dhan pratikartum so to to take revenge so udyukta asit she wanted to take revenge upon rama and lakshmana who had brought about apadita vanta who had brought about aswa anga vairupyam who had brought a anga vairupyam that is ugliness to her form and so she wanted to take revenge on them hence she went and proclaimed to kara and other rakshasas that this is a paribhava this is a humiliation for the entire rakshasa kula okay Hmm. so if you want you can have this janasthanam as janasya sthanam or i would prefer to remove this don't take this as a vigraha vakya here because janasthanam is a name by itself uh, so leave it as is kharadibhya kharaha adihi yeshante this is a bahubrihi there are two kinds of bahubrihi so um, there is something called ತದ್ಗುಣ ಬಹುಬ್ರೀಹಿ ಅತದ್ಗುಣ ಬಹುಬ್ರೀಹಿ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಬಹುಬ್ರೀಹಿ ಯೂಶ್ವಲಿ ಡಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಇಂಡಿಕೇಟ್ ದ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದಟ್ ಓಕೆ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಬಿಯಾಂಡ್ ಯುವರ್ ಪೇಗ್ರೇಟ್ ಯುವರ್ ಬಟ್ ದೆನ್ ಐಮ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಸಿಂಪ್ಲಿ ಟೆಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ಯು ವಾಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಇನ್ ಅ ವೇ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ರೀಡಿಂಗ್ ಅದರ್ ಟೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ so there is something when you look at a common bahubrihi compound what is it the common example that we have is pitam ambaram yasya saha pitam ambaraha pitam yellow color ambaram vastram yasya saha whoever is having this yellow vastram so who is that so when we say pitam ambaraha kashchana purushaha athava vishnu iti vadamaha so vishnu is the person who has yellow cloth Peetam iti chet, it indicates yellow. Ambaram indicates the vastram. Whereas when I put both of them together in a bahubrihi and say peetam baraha, it does not indicate peetam or ambaram, but it indicates someone else who is having this yellow cloth. The word only points to a person. It does not point to the vastram. It does not point to the color. Right? so that's why we say anya pada pradhanyam it is a it gives importance to some other person but in such compounds where you use adi pramukha ityadi then what is that it is a tadguna bahubrihi that is it points out to the word itself for example when i say kharaha adihi yeshamte there is a group of people for whom khara is the first person kharaha adihi yeshamte there is a group of yeshamte all of those people who are there are kharadibhya no it refers to the group 
where khara is also present it's not like this pitam ambaram where that pitam is it doesn't indicate pitam right here it indicates khara also it indicates the others also so this is it this is also a regular bahuvrihi only but the final padam indicates the individual words also that's the difference between a regular the other bahuvrihis and this bahuvrihi we use this in brahma sutram when we say janmadyasya yataha yataha janmadi from whom janma etc have come that means janma adi asya saha then you say janma also is included in that the others are also srishti sthiti and layam is included hmm. just if you can understand the difference otherwise just forget it uh, we'll go to the next one tatha vidham tatha vidha yasya saha tatha vidha tam because this is an adjective to rakshasam paribhavah uh, uh, you take it as yasya saha here and as an adjective for rakshav paribhavah uh, rakshasam paribhavah this ramasya upakramam there is a um, speciality in this word when you use the word upakrama and upagnya one minute let me see if i can pull up uh, mallinathas uh, text uh, he gives a specific uh, this thing for it so see the vyakhyanam of mallinatha um ha rama upakramam is there right so ramasya upakramah ramasya kartuhu upakramah rama is the karta here who has done this beginning upakramah ityukte upakrama upasamharan solrom so upakrama is actually introduction and upasamhara is the conclusion so this is something that has been introduced by rama he has started it so when you use the word upakrama in the sense of starting then it the resultant tatpurusha compound should be in napunsaka lingam only it cannot be a uh, pullinga padam even though whenever we make something vidyayah alayah tarhi vidyalayah it only stays as a pullinga padam but here what happens is ramasya upakramah becomes ramopakramam it is only in napunsaka linga because there is a sutram which says upagnya and upakramam tad adya uh, aachikhyasayam tad adya aachikhyasayam tad adya aachikhyasayam so when you want to use that in a uh, 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 tatpurusha compound then the resulting tatpurusha compound is klibatvam kliba is napunsaka linga so even though rakshasam paribhavah uh, navah tatavidah all three words are in pullinga still ramopakramam will be treated as a napunsaka linga padam is that clear uh, okay why can't i share this <laughs> sorry i wanted to share the book back one minute let me pause that tata yeah. vidam did she actually tell everything that happened that she went to rama then to lakshmana all those things did she tell or not? she must have told it see when you use words like tatha vidam appadi sonna abadina anda madri nadanda ramanudaya abdingrom alliyo so it's only a gesture it's a the poet is trying to say that she said everything in that same manner iti but she must have used an exaggeration there when she said it it's a she played the victim card right mm so that's so tatha vidam is only what it means is in such a manner in the same way or whatever happened iti you will have to fill in mm whatever you want it's mm-hmm. only an indication that's all indication that she, she tathavidam raksha tathavidam ramopakramam the rama upakrama whatever was started by rama in that following manner she said it as a raksha paribhava ha so ava apdida sonnala illiyanna apdida sonna nu eduthukano because the tatha has so much of force there in a kavya hmm? okay prapyacha aashu janasthanam 
खरा दिव्यस्तथा विधम रामोपक्रम आचख्यौ रक्ष परिभव नव मुखावयवलूना तां नैरता यत्पुरो दधु रायिना तदे अभूत अमंगल मुख अवयवलूना दधु नैरता पुरा दधु नैरता आर् राक्षस अगेन सो इन अमरकोश नैरता नैरतो या तो रक्षसी सो वेन दे इन अमरकोश वेन दे गिव द पर्यायवाची शब्द नैरता इज इन पुलिंग पदम सो नैरता इज बहुवचन देर निर्रति इज ए वन ऑफ द वन ऑफ द पीपल हू वर् क्रियेटेड एंड निर्रति इज ऑलो अनदर मीनिंग फॉर निर्रति इज अशुभम एंड सो निर्रत निर्रते अपत्यम अपत्या नैरता so one who those who were born to nirrati are called the nairrata they are also another uh, um, uh, sect of uh, rakshasas so nairrataha whether these people are also there of the whether they were uh, asura or nairrata or danava or diti this sort of a distinction we don't find in general in kavyas every rakshasa will be called a danuja at some point he will be called a yatudana sometimes sometimes he will danujaha ityukte danu iti she is also one of the daughters of daksha i think uh, diti is also one one daughter and uh, nirrati is another person so in actually you cannot intermix and use but if the descendants could be connected in some way or the other and because of their mental makeup everybody has that asuratvam quality in them so they can be interchanged and called in whatever manner they want so that's why you will find the word nairrata being used here despite the fact that they are descendants of kaikashi or pururavas or someone else even though right uh, you just take it as a common term which is a synonymous to rakshasa so nairrataha all of those rakshasas khara and others what did they do they placed her in front of them like a flag hmm? because uh, they are going to fight for shurpanaka so they have to take shurpanaka with them to show that these they, they have not come without reason they have come here because shurpanaka was disfigured and they are coming in protection for their sister here so tam puraha dadhu they placed her puraha in front of them and went now how was she tam itute mukha avayava luna her her face the parts of her face were loose luna luna is cut um uh, 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 luna angirathu is a um, dhatu uh, kushala uh, lati ha i was trying to figure out what was the latlakara for it hmm? yeah lati idane uh, i need to check that okay if, if you can just check and tell me so mukha avayava luna mukham मुखस्यवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवाहवयवा
it's it's not indicating some particular object it is indicating one fact so here you split it into two parts and say yat mukha avayavalunam tam nairutaha puraha daduhu tat ramabhiyayinam tesham amangalam abhut tadeva the fact that they had placed someone whose part, the parts of her face had been cut off in front of them that itself tadeva amangalam abhut it became an amangala suchakam ashubham was something inauspicious for these people tesham for those rakshasas who were uh, uh, approaching rama rama abhiyayinam ramam prati gachanti iti so they were uh, going towards rama and hence they needed something which was uh, um, uh, uh, something that is uh, uh, shubha suchakam right but instead this became an ashubha suchakam for them is that clear so nairutaha rakshasaha mukha avayava lunam mukha avayaveshu karnadishu chinnam mukha avayavaha karna nasika karnau and nasika tatra chinnam idi bhavati or um, mukha nam avayavaha mukha avayavaha lunaha yasyaha sa okay so one whose uh, uh, parts of the face were cut off right so mukha avayaveshu chinna you can use this way also but don't use this as a for the vigraha vakyam you cannot explain the vigraha vakyam in this manner because there is no sutram that supports it instead you will use it as mukha avayavaha karnadayaha yasya chinnaha yasyaha so whose mukha avayava parts were chinna were cut so the cut is not for her but the cut part goes only for the parts you understand so confusing a irukum huh? the lunam is only a, an adjective for the mukha avayava it's not for her but she was a person who had her parts cut off tam shurpana kham puraha dadhuhu agre chakruhu iti yat agre sthapayamasuhu they placed her in front iti yat vartate the fact that they did this that itself tadeva um ha you should have a tadeva here iti yat tadeva rama abhiyayinam ramam abhidravatam ramam prati gachatam those who were running towards rama to kill him because they knew that this was started by rama tesham rakshasanam amangalam abhut ashubham abhut this became inauspicious okay you ask someone to lead who who will who is an indication of something is giving victory if you are going to place someone who is disfigured in front of you that itself is like an auspicious inauspicious thing for them and that's why the entire army was destroyed okay kharad this is a this is an indication by the poet uh, uh, that is ashubham eva bhavati bhavishyati iti kharadayah rakshasaha छिन्न कर्ण नासा शूर्पण खा अग्रे राम अभिद्रुतवंत सो खरा एंड अदर राक्षस दे प्लेस्ड शूर्पण का इन फ्रंट ऑफ देम हूज नोस एंड इयर्स वेर कट ऑफ अग्रे कृत्वा प्लेसिंग हर इन फ्रंट राम अभिद्रुतवंत दे वेट टूवर्ड्स दे रैन टूवर्ड्स राम तदेव तेषा अमंगल करम आसीत दैट बिकेम एन इनोस्पिशियस थिंग फॉर देम ओके एनी डाउट्स इन दिस इज दिस प्रॉब्लम ओनली इफ इट्स अ मुख अवयवलुना और एनी अदर आल्सो बिकॉज़ लॉट ऑफ पीपल इन द वार्स एंड ऑल दे गेट लॉट ऑफ soldiers get um, disabled like that right hands legs and all okay. yes. that means can, they cannot be leading any division yeah they can't they they are very you know people were actually very sympathetic towards people who were disabled and uh, they gave them employment uh, so they did not make them fight again ha <laughs> ha huh. they had the people in rotation coming in right okay Ma'am, this Nair Rita also means uh, direction, southwest direction, nilia. Yeah? Ah, so southwest direction, nilia. The <laughs> Adhipati for the southwest direction is Nir Nir Rita, Nair Rita. Oh, okay, okay. 
ஈசான்ய மூலம் கிரோம் இல்லையா ஐந்திரிய மூலம் அதெல்லாம் வந்து திசான் அதிபதி ஒண்ணு திக்கு டிரெக்ஷனுக்கு வந்து தேர் ஆர் டிஃபரெண்ட் நேம்ஸ் ஃபார் இட் பிராச்சி சவுத் வெஸ்ட் எடுத்துட்டோம்னா தட்சிண பசிம திக் தட்சிண பசிமி திக்குன்னு இருக்குன்னு நினைக்கிறேன் So, the Adhipati, Dikpati in one another call you. So, each Dik has a specific Adhipati and the Adhipati for that Dik is Nirrita. Okay, got it. Yeah. South Kvandi Yaman, Anumadri. Yamyam Gachatimbo. There is a usage, Yamya Abdina, it's a southern direction. Yes, Yamaha Eva Adhipati, Sadik Yamya. That's it. முகாவயவலூனாம் தாம் நைரிதா எத் புரோ தூஹு ராமாபியாயினாம் தேஷாம் ததேவாபூத் அமங்களம் அபி அபியாதி இஸ் அபிகச்சதி யாதி யா இஸ் த தாது ஃபார் கச்சதி சோ அபியாதி மீன்ஸ் பிரதியாதி ஒன் ஹூ அபிமுகம் யாதி ஒன் ஹூ கோஸ் டுவர்ட்ஸ் இது உதாயுதான் ஆபதஸ்தான் திருப்தான் பிரேட்ச ராகவஹ நிததே விஜயாசம் சாம் சாபே சீதாம் ச லட்சுமணே he saw those rakshasas who were coming udayudhana they had taken their uh, weapons in their hand uh, uh, with raised weapons udayudhan udyata ayudhana tan rakshasan so tan is your karma padam here prekshya after seeing who saw them raghava so raghava ramah udayudan apatatah driptan tan Prekshya, after seeing those Rakshasas, Tan, who were Udayudhana, who had their weapons raised, Apatataha, Apatati is running, coming, uh, running towards them, towards uh, Rama. So, Apatataha, here is Apatan, is in Shatru Pritya, and uh, Apatataha is uh, um, Dvitiya Bahuvachanam. அஹங்கிருத்தான் after seeing those Rakshasas who were coming, Raghava, he placed Sita under Lakshmana's care. Lakshmane Sitaam Nidadhe. So in the second line you have Nidadhe Vijayasham Saam Chape Sitaam Cha Lakshmane. So Chape Vijayasham Saam Nidadhe Lakshmane Sitaam Cha Nidadhe. He placed two things with two people or two things. so one is a person the other is a padartha so he placed his ashamsa that uh, his his expectation of victory vijaya ashamsam he placed the uh, confidence of victory in his bow chape and in lakshmana he placed sita for protection so nidadhe is placing dadhe um, dha dato ho litlakara hmm? so ni is the upasarga here he placed sita under the protection of lakshmana and he placed his uh, 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 the the wish for victory in his bow that is he relied only on his one bow and single handedly he killed all of them it's going to come later so udayudhan apatatah tan driptan prekshya raghavah udayudhan udyata ayudhan ut is an upasarga it's a um, it's if you see here udyatam ayudham yaihi te so udayudha it's a pradi bahuvrihi na prati illa pradi you can have pra upa ud ut all of these upasargas can also come in the form of a in the bahuvrihi compound so this is one such example so udyatam ayudham yaihi te or udyatani ayudhani one person can have two three ayudhams also Uh, assuming they each one has only one ayudha so udyata ayudan apatatah agachatah those who were running towards him driptan darpena uddhatan darpa here is ahankara uddhata is a person who is very proud or one who is in the timrindavardhangramalya ada 
உத்தன ஐ டோன்ட் நோ ஹவு டு சே இன் அதர் லாங்குவேஜஸ் இது வந்து கொஞ்சம் ஒன் ஹூ இஸ் வெரி ஹாட்டி பிகாஸ் ஆஃப் தட் ப்ரைட் தட் தே ஹாவ் திஸ் த க்ளோசஸ்ட் ஐ கேன் சே எதிர்த்து நிக்கிறது எம்பா திருப்த தான் கராதீன் பிரேட்சிய திருஷ்டா ராகவ ராம சாப்பே தனுஷி விஜயாசம் சாம் விஜயஸ் ஆஷாம் லக்ஷ்மணே சீதாம் சிதே நிகிதவான் ஸ்தாபிதவான் சுவாவா யுத்தாய ஆகதான் கராதீன் திருஷ்டா ஆஃப்டர் சீங் கரா அண்ட் அதர்ஸ் ஹூ ஹெட் கம் ஃபார் யுத்தம் ராம சீதாரணே லக்ஷ்மணம் நியோஜ்ய Dhanurdhari vijigeshuhu tasthau. Okay. It's completely, it's not a direct uh, word, but it's more like a tatparyam here. Sita rakshane lakshmanam niyojya after placing or appointing lakshmana uh, to protect Sita. Dhanurdhari carrying a chapa, carrying a dhanus bow in his hand. Vijigeshuhu wanting to win. So, Vijayasham Sam Nidade, he just changes it to Vijigishu. Vijayatum Icha Yasya Saha. So, one who has the interest to win, one who has the desire to win is a Vijigishu. That's how he stood there waiting for them to come. Udayudhan, Apatatastan, Dhriptan, Preksha Raghavaha. Nidade, Vijayasham Sam Chape Sitaam Cha Lakshmane. This is clear. Ha, this is an Alankara called Sahopti. See, uh, it has to happen in succession. If two things are said to happen at the same time, using the word cha, then it is sahokti. You have vijayasham saam chape, lakshmane sitaam cha, nidadhe. He must have placed uh, sita, he must have called lakshmana and said, you know, take care of her and then taken the bow. and he, he you cannot place your desire on the bow there is no physical uh, placing of it there this is more like a beautiful expression of saying he placed his uh, desire on that bow that is he had the confidence on the of that bow uh, in that bow just as how he had the confidence of protecting sita in lakshmana he knew that lakshmana could protect sita the same way he knew that his bow could help him in attaining victory both are expressed together in the same sentence using the word cha saha ukti two things two separate ideas are combined together in one sentence and said together so this alankara is called sahokti that clear ah udayudhan apatatas tan driptan preksha raghavah nidadhe vijayasham sam chape sitam cha lakshmane okay ஏகோ தாசரதி காமம் யாதுதானா சஹசிரஷ தே து யாவந்த ஏவாஜோ தாவான்ஷே ச தை திஸ் எபிசோட் இஸ் டிஸ்கிரைப்ட் வெரி பியூட்டிஃபுல்லி பை வால்மீகி இன் ஹிஸ் ராமாயண திஸ் எபிசோட் தேர் ஆர் மெனி சர்காஸ் அண்ட் அவர் காளிதாச ஹெஸ் ஜஸ்ட் கம்பைண்ட் ஆல் ஆஃப் தோஸ் சர்காஸ் இன் டூ ஜஸ்ட் அூ ஸ்லோகாஸ் இயர் த வே ஹி ஃபைட்ஸ் ஹேஸ் அ பியூட்டிஃபுல் டிஸ்கிரிப்ஷன் ஏகோ தாசரதி காமம் ஏகா தாசரதி யாதுதானாக காமம் சஹசிரஷ ஹவு மெனி எவர் தே வாண்டெட் தேர் வர் தௌசண்ட்ஸ் ஆஃப் ராட்சசாஸ் தேர் யதேச்சம் காமம் இது or you can even say sahasrashah astu let there be thousands of yatudana and just one dasharathi ekah dasharathi hi there with dasharathi dasharathasya uh, uh, putrah sah ramah ekah eva asit he was just single handedly standing there uh, with no help at all or chapat dvitiya you can say that he had uh, uh, only his bow as his helper there he was single alone yatudhanaha kamam sahasrashah you can include it in two ways one is they were uh, as they pleased they were thousands of rakshasas there kamam sahasrashah sahasrashah ittute sahasram 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 thousands and thousands in general yeah when you say thousands it means sahasrashah there it is not just 1000 but there were thousands it is uh, beyond the sankhya 
uh, it, it was difficult to count how many thousands were there. So you just say uh, in thousands. So the Yatudanaha, Rakshasas, were present there in thousands. You, you can even say Yatudanaha Sahasrashaha Kamam. Kamam astu bhavantu. Let there be only one Rama and thousands of Rakshasas. It doesn't matter. But then the way Rama was seen by them was such that how many ever Rakshasas were there, that many Ramas were seen. Tetu yavantaha eva ajau. Ajau yudhe. Aji is yuddham. So ajau in the battle. Te Rakshasaha Yavantaha Asan. How many ever Yavat is a Sankhya? You, when uh, Yavan, Tavan, Yavat, Tavat, you use it to as a uh, measure. It, it, uh, it is not a specific number, but how many ever were there? That many were here also. So it is more of a comparison between the two measures. So Yamantaha Te Asan Ajo in the battle, how many ever Rakshasas were there? Saha Ramaha Tamans Chataihi Dadrishe. Rama was seen as so many Tavan Dadrishe. He was seen. Dadrishe here is in Karmani Prayoga. Taihi Saha Dadrishe. So Te Rakshasaha Tam Ramam. Tavantaha, Tavataha, Dadrushuhu. This is your uh, Kartri Prayoga. Dadrishe is Drishtaha. He was seen. Who was seen? Rama was seen by them, by the Rakshasas. In that, that many number of Rama were seen. See, it's actually, when you uh, read the description in uh, Ramayana, Rama was traveling with such speed and he was capable of... Uh, uh, throwing so many arrows, shooting so many arrows at the same time that every Rakshasa felt that he was individually fighting with one drama. He moved from one place to another place in such speed that it seemed as if they, it's like relativity. Yeah? You know, it, it seems like there are two, three people at the same time. No? Uh, the, the speed with which they move. Uh, that's what it is. So, or the distance also matters. You can have because of distance or because of speed also. Distance, an example is uh, the Surya, sun or moon. The moon is there. Uh, uh, let's say in the same time zone, everywhere, every person can see that moon because of the distance. So you say, I saw the moon here in above my head. Someone in San Diego says, I saw the moon above my head. Then it, uh, it, does that mean that there are two moons? That is because of distance. Right? It's just one person. Huh? In Ramadantam, right? Ramadantam, yes. Uh -huh. yeah. Yes. Laghu Vikramaha. That's what this is. He was so fast that within a blink of an eye, they saw him here and there. So they thought that there were so many Ramas there. Eko dasaratihi kamam vyatudana sahasrashaha tetu yavantaha eva ajo. How many ever they were at the battlefield, they all saw him as so many tavans saha taihi dadrishe. This is just in Karmani Prayoga. So dasaratihi ramaha ekaha ekaki alone. Vyatudhanaha rakshasaha sahasrashaha sahasra gunena santi kamam. Sahasra gunena, gunam here is not guna quality, but guna is multiplied. So sahasra shaha is in thousands. Santi, there were there. Kamam, let it be. It doesn't matter. Astu, iti. Ajau, but in the yuddham, yudhe pravritte sati, when the battle had started, the moment the battle started, oh, he takes it as uh, sati saptami here. You can just take it as ajau during the battle. When the battle had started or during the battle, te yatudanaha, yavantaha, yavat sankhyakaha, how many ever there were, tavan eva, so many tavat sankhyakaha eva, saha ramaha, taihi rakshasaihi dadrishe drishtaha. So tavan, huh? tavan is in prathama ekavachanam as an adjective to saha ramaha here. So, Tavan, if you want to change it to Karmani Prayoga, then you will say 
ते तावंतम तम ददृशु यद्यपि युद्धरंगे रामः एकाकी राक्षसा तो सहस्रसंख्या युद्धे प्रवृत्ते तैहि युद्धन रामः एवं दृष्टः यावत् संख्याकाहा ते राक्षसाह आसन स्प्लिट इट एंड इट बी इजी सो यद्यपि तथापि इज वन क्लास एंड विद इन दट तथापि यू हैव अनदर यावत् तावत् क्लास सो यद्यपि इवन दो युद्ध रंगे इन द बैटल फील्ड रामः एकाकी रामा वाज अलोन राक्षसाह तो सहस्र संख्याकाह Rakshasas were thousand in number. Tathapi, even then, Yudhe pravritte, when the battle had started, Taihi drishtaha Ramaha. By those Rakshasas, Rama was seen. How was he seen? Yudhyan Ramaha drishtaha. How was Rama seen? Tavat sankhya kaha eva drishtaha. He was seen as so many by them. Yavat sankhya kaha, sankhya kaha te Rakshasaha asan. You understand how the class works here? So, Taihi uh, Tul Asan is actually one sentence here. So, Taihi Rakshasaihi Yudhyan Ramaha, the fighting Rama, Tavat Sankhya Kaha Eva Drishtaha. Rama was seen as so many, as how many Rakshasas were there. This is one sentence here, but they have combined it with the Yadhyapi Tatapi into another sentence and made it into a complicated sentence. Okay. Ramasya Yuddha Kaushalam Shastra Astra Prayoga Naipunyam Cha Tathavidam Iti Bhavaha. Now this is, this is a Dhvani here. This is a Dhvani Ityukte. This is something that is suggested from the Shloka. So when he describes the Shloka, there can be some other meaning that comes to the mind when you uh, 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 read the Shloka or when you get the Artham of the Shloka. What stands out in the shloka is rama's fighting capacity was such that he could the, the the speed with which he fought was just amazing so he had that ability to fight that ability is what is seen as a suggestion here is that clear so yuddha kaushalam his expertise in fighting and shastra astra prayoga naipunyam his expertise in using shastra and astra that is weapons and uh, mantra purvaka weapons विग्रह वाक्य मुंगली दाशरथ से अपत्यम भूमान द रेस्ट आर ऑल फाइन एको दाशरथ एक कामम यातुजाना सहस्रशह ते तो यावंता ये वाजो तावांस च ददरशे सह तैहि हाँ नेक्स्ट इस दूषणा हाउ ही किल्ड दूषणा सो वी विल डू दैट नेक्स्ट क्लास एनी डाउट्स सो फार um, for men, that virupun and all is considered like a prestigious thing, right? Virupun. Uh -huh. But it's not so for uh, Shurpanaka. It's Adhi not... Virupun vera, unglaku vandhi disfiguration vera. Hmm. Yeah, virupun vandhi, it is only a battle scar. This is not a battle scar. She did not get it from a battle. Hmm. It's uh, It is only a, a humiliation that she went through. So that itself is an Ashubha Suchakam. Okay, okay. Ah. If it was a battle scar, it would be the same. It would be proud of the concept. Okay. Any other doubts? Okay. 